Hello there and welcome back. In this video we are going to talk about monkey type. So monkey type is going to allow you to dynamically uh, type annotate uh, your scripts and uh, this is based on Python runtime information and the kind of opposite to this would be what Pyre does. It is going to be using statically information from your scripts. And here is how you can use it. So first we need to install monkey type. And once it is installed, we can open up our favorite text editor. And we can create a myscript.py and we can create a module called sum inside here module.py and what we would like to do is to create an add function a and b which returns a plus b and uh, what we can also do is, let's say, multiply a and b and return a times b. And inside the my script, what we can do is to import from some module the add and the multiply. And we could call add with 1 and 2 and multiply with five and six. Now if we go ahead and go back to our console what we can do is to call the monkey type and at first if you don't provide any argument it is going to give you back the help message. So if you use the monkey type run my script what will happen is that inside this directory a SQLite 3 file is created and if you open up a SQLite browser and open the database desktop monkey type and then so if you open up SQLite 3 and say the browse table you can see that the following entries were added and basically what you can see here is the date it was created the module the qualified name the argument types and the return type and uh, this is the information which is applied to the sqlite database and if we go back and run the monkey type apply some module. What you will see here in the output is the <coughs> type information which was guessed by monkey type based on runtime. And uh, now if we go back to our my module, you can see that these functions got type annotated. And uh, there are many other things that you could do with the help of monkey type and this was basically an introduction as to how you can do these things. Check out the documentation if you want to see in more details. See you in the next one.